we know what the Heat can do. They're, they're always in striking differences. I mean, the reason is, Chris, they're such a, a good defensive team. Nice job there by Walker. Quentin Jackson starts the fourth quarter. That's how Shep can play in there. Adebayo misses. Rebound by Walker. Walker, McConnell, Toppin, Turner, Jackson. He's due to get them. McConnell needs help. Gets it way up top now to Turner. Three seconds. Okay. Somehow Toppin got it back, and McConnell scores. Oh, that's a good sign. When you find a way to come up with a ball that essentially should be theirs, and then you get a bucket out of it, that's a good sign. You got to capitalize on it. Great work there by both of those Pacers to give them a 12-point lead. Robinson on the baseline. Richardson. It's on Turner. KJ McConnell in his sixth season with the Pacers. And fighting over the screen. That's one Quentin Jackson. This is tough. Jackson, Jackson playing in his fifth game, played in a handful of games a year ago, was acquired by Indiana on a two-way contract late last year. He's on a two-way contract with Enrique Freeman and Tristan Newton, a pair of rookies the Pacers got in the draft. Hero looked at a long three. Shot clock down to five. Robinson turns the corner. Into the corner, one. Jackson flew by. And Hero hit the three. Tyler Hero has three of them. And he's got 12. Toppa needs some help. Yeah, he got it out of there, too. Turner really fighting with Richardson. Here's McConnell. Got it to Miles and hits. 26 for Turner. Hero gets an open three and hits again. Yeah. Hey, you can't hit a screen and go down on Hero. You got to play him. I mean, I don't care what happens. You got to make sure you get up on him. Miami is only shooting 39.5% from the field, but 41% from distance. They've made 14 threes. Turner missed it. Rebound comes out to Robinson. The Indiana lead was 16. It's been cut to eight. Robinson is fouled by Jackson. Yeah, that's that's another foul he picked up there, and, and that's almost the same kind of foul. Remember, Shepard got hard to stop. When I mean, you're chasing these guys coming off the three-point line, Jackson brings you great energy, but on this one, it's one you got to get there late. Pacers outscored the Heat 33-26 in the third quarter, led by 10 after three. Earlier had a 12-point lead, but Robinson cutting into that and a message from Rally House. Get ready for tip-off, Indy. Some big numbers for Duncan Robinson. Tough spot to put Jackson in the game, but he had to come in. And he did, you know, he did what you would expect. He got some uh, un two unexpected fouls, both on three-point shots. All three free throws for Robinson, six and a half, 17 in the game. And the Pacers' lead is just five. Chris, historically, the Pacers playing the Heat is always a close game. Matherin came back in for Jackson. It's on Siaka. No, I you sure had it not on Matherin. There, there is, let's see, they're, they're saying Siaka. Is that on the screen? Yeah. Halliburton has come back in. Robinson yeah, to the they, wing. They put size out there. Siaka. He rose. Too late. No good. Siaka the rebound. Running Indiana, they lob it up, and Toppin throws it down. So you don't have many in the league that can get up and down the floor with the size. Like Toppin, who went over the top for that one. Tyrese Halliburton is 12th assist. 
Adebayo again for three. I'm telling you, he's really become a good three-point shooter. He, he couldn't do any of this two years ago. Siakam goes inside. Up off that was the glass. a foul. Yeah, that's no doubt. That's a foul. He didn't to, you could tell the way the ball the came out of his hands. I mean, just a really good job. Kind of, 10,000. He got fouled by just staying active. Here, mine is going on the other end. And they've been hunting threes between Adebayo, Robinson, and Hero. Halliburton, the free throw good. Now, a message from Auto Owners Insurance. Auto Owners thinks the more you protect. Pacers have the Raptors tomorrow night. They are just 2 and 12 on the year, but last night, Celtics had to make a buzzer beater by Jason Tatum to beat the Raptors in Boston. Don't go away. If he ball fakes you, 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 you got to stay up. And that's what Rick Coach Carlisle is going to tell you. If you make a mistake. Second half points. It's important to come out of this time out and get a good shot, Chris. Because the Pacers have really struggled. You know, look, look how much time they're taking to get a decent shot here. Matherin. He's going to step through and get the layup. That's big. It really is. The fact that, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, he came to a two foot stop initially allowed him to take one more step after he gathered the ball to get a layup. He's got 19. Most. That's Pacers' ball. You see, Alcum knocked. Ooh, see, Alcum knocked that. Didn't he knock that off his leg? Wait a minute. He knocked it off his leg. They're going to challenge this. Yeah, they're going to challenge it. It's off his leg. What I thought about it, you know, I give my little two cents worth, but no, they, it's it's much more sophisticated than, than that now. Well, I'm telling you what, though, you are a guy that's used to pressure, so you can handle that. I don't, I don't call it pressure. You just see what you, you know how it is. You call the same thing. You just see what you see. Shot clock down to four. Matherin has to go to work. They've got a double on him. That's not going to get up. McConnell gets it away. And a foul, loose ball on Siaka. That was another possession that would deepen the shot clock. Yeah, it sure was. And it's one more man. The problem is penalty. Yeah. That's yeah, the fifth, fifth of the quarter. And we still have 6.20 to play. And Miami is a perfect 13 of 13 at the line. Jovic, back-to-back double-figure games off the bench for Miami. He had 11 on Friday, 11 tonight, and now with 12. Boy, I tell you what, in two years, he's really good. He's helping them now. Two years, he's really going to help them. He's only 21 years old. Right, he's, he's a young man. And off to Siakam. He's guarded by Robinson, McConnell. But, but you got to get something going to the basket. See, this the pace is on the perimeter. The shot clock at five. Here's Halliburton out to Turner. Turner's got to shoot it quick. And the ball tipped That's out of bounds. Pacers ball, shouldn't it? Oh, they call Miami ball. And now halfway through the quarter, Miami has it with a chance to tie. This is one of those moments on the defensive end. That Air and Eric Spolster knows it. You need to get a stop. Indiana has led the entire game. Oh, well, they see the mismatch. Robinson comes off that screen, oh. and we're tied. Oh, you can see him come off that screen. Now, ladies and gentlemen, Siakam with length couldn't get there. First tie of the game. The Pacers scored the game's first eight and never have trailed. Siakam in trouble. Nice job to come bail him out. He was about to get three seconds. Turner for three. McConnell with the loose ball. Halliburton. Give me one. Three. Give me one. Give me one. Yet. Give me three. Tyrese Halliburton from the hustle play of McConnell. Indiana by three. Less than five to play. Robinson again. Well guarded that time by McConnell. They use that high ball screen with Adebayo. Jovic. McConnell, smallest on the floor, the rebound. 
Yeah, I didn't give it to him there. Halliburton He's got another, another one. Three. Yeah. Yeah. Tyrese! Back-to-back -back threes by Tyrese Halliburton, urging the 16,000-plus to get on their feet. Hero fouled. And it's on McConnell. Two big threes by Tyrese Halliburton. Really good job. But he's got a ball handler on the floor. But look, he's better at home than he is on the road. But I'm glad to see he's <laughs> come alive here. 16 and 12. He's shooting just 29% on the year from three-point range. He is three of seven tonight. But two big back-to-back -back threes by Halliburton as Rozier checks in. Checks in a little smaller. Yeah, the singles out there a little smaller. They've got Jovic, Adebayo, Robinson, Hero, and Rozier. See, and all five can shoot the three. Yeah, and, and Jovic is big enough. This is part of the reason he's in. He's, yeah, he, he can guard Miles Turner because they put Adebayo on Siakam. That's why we haven't heard much from Siakam. Halliburton dancing. Here's another oh, he's three. It hits short. Yeah, he was feeling it because that was a tough shot, but that was a heat check as well. Four minutes to play. Pacers trying to even the season series after losing the NBA Cup game here on Friday. Hero on the baseline. Rebound by Matherin. He climbed the ladder, and Jovic fouled him. Jovic takes that mask off momentarily. Really good challenge there. And coming over the top is Matherin. When that's his ninth rebound, they've asked him to be a better rebounder, and he has responded. Another clutch game for the Pacers. Inside five. A five-point game. Here's Matherin got there, and he draws the five. And so more. At that point, I was looking because I thought he was about to have a double-double. Matherin at the line. Averaging just shy of 20 points per game. He was almost at 20 at 19.9. He's at 18.8 coming in. And his free throw was good. He's got 20 for the seventh time this year. I mean, this is a big difference from what you had as you have the game night special. Oh, a nice fleece. It's the Indiana Pacers Cosmos hooded fleece. Shop tonight's exclusive game night special and more online at PacersTeamStore.com. It's the city edition game night special. You said, I, I think I saw you. you, you were I got one of the hats. Yeah. 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 Oh, it's, it's sweet. And I don't usually wear hats that other than the muted colors, but I like this color. Three and a half to play. Six point Pacers lead. He had one tie, and then Halliburton hit back to back threes. Jovic. Out of value with five to shoot. And he got it. Another big second half for Bam Adebayo. He's got 23, 15 in the second half. You got to play some quick with these guys. Because you get in the scrum with them, they, that's how they play. Turner, catch, shoot, three by Miles Turner. Plan with confidence. Fourth of the night for Turner. He's got 29. You got you to go. Siaka called for the foul. His fifth. Bayo stays at 23. <laughs> 250 to play. Pacers lead the league in clutch games. This is their 10th. 10 of their first 13. They are 5 and 4. Trying for a sixth win. Two for Adebayo. Denying Halliburton the ball is Rozier. The good thing about it, you got another ball handler in TJ McConnell. Because that really would slow up the offense if you only had one ball handler in. Then you get the ball back to him, the hero. McConnell goes in. Big play, big play. Rebound tipped. There's the tenth rebound, Matherin. Well, Halibu yeah. Adebayo got away with a foul. And Turner was standing out of bounds. The year. 
He had three coming into the season. Part of the improvement, Chris. Robinson guarded by Matherin. You got to get up, Miles. And he missed it. Rebound tip. Turner tips it to Matherin. I like it because he was aggressive going after the rebound. He could have got an offensive foul. But at this point, just be aggressive. Two minutes to play. Give it back to Siakam and let him go to work. Inside, Siakam adds two more. He's got 23. Woo! From the time he got to his spot, you could see the rhythm that he was in, and he was just still that thrilled. It. Six of them tonight for Tyler Hero. They've hit 18 threes. 90 seconds to play. Pacers by five. Siakam got out of Bayou to bite. McConnell. That's a button. Spot. You could see the rhythm. And Duncan Robinson, if, if you're going to do anything, you, you let the other, whomever the screen is, you let them be the ones that open. Oh, no, 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 no. And he's out. That's on Siakam. That's his sixth. We'll be topping this up off the bench to check in. The night is over for Pascal Siakam. 23 points, 9 of 11 from the field, 4 rebounds and 2 assists. Continues to put up huge numbers for the Pacers. Both teams have 3 players with at least 20 points. Turner 32, Siakam 23, Matherin 21. For the Heat, 28 for Hero, 24 for Adebayo, and 20 for Duncan Robinson. Nineteen threes tonight for Miami. That's the second most they've made in a game this year. They have made 20 and they've been brilliant at the free throw line. 18 of 19. Jovic five of five, now six of six. I'm right, gonna need a little help because they, they've got full court, court pressure. Gotta get it in. Good call. Good call. Really good call. That's why you like your point guard taking the ball out because they are happy. Pacers have one timeout remaining. Miami has none. You can throw it deep into the backcourt, and that's where McConnell gets it. He's going to go all the way to the basket and lay it in. Did a nice job. They knew they were going to face the front, if you will, Tyrese Halliburton. But McConnell, very good, just reacted. Out of bio. Richardson the rebound, top and stumbled. Now Robinson is looking. Nice blocked. job by Halliburton. He came across and got that block. And that should do it for the Pacers with 23 Ooh. seconds to play. Turner is going to put a cap on it. The moments tonight, the Pacers have really stepped up, Chris. Got the block when you needed to get it. And Toppin and the Pacers will snap a two-game losing streak and answer Friday night's loss here to the Heat with a 119-110. It was an embarrassing loss. It wasn't just a loss. They came back. For